Associate Professor Claire Dyson from RMIT. Claire, can I get you to come up? Before I get you to do your official welcome, I want to thank you again for all the work that you've done to help get this thing underway because RMIT have been absolutely wonderful. This, these meeting spaces are incredible and uh, it's been a joy to work with you and to work with RMIT. So thank you so much. You're so welcome. And let's have you do the official welcome. I'll get you to clip that on so everyone can hear online. There we go. Hi, everyone. It's lovely to be here. Um, and it's lovely to welcome everyone for the second day of the Adobe Educators Conference. Um, as Tim said, I'm uh, Claire Dyson and I'm the director of RMIT's Adobe Creative Campus. Um, and I'd like to start today's, um, uh, I was going to say celebration, because it kind of is, isn't it? But series of workshops and networking events and coming together of like-minded people um, by acknowledging the people of the Woiwurrung and the Boomerang language groups of the East Kulin Nations on whose unceded land we're going to be gathering, learning and playing today. I'd also like to respectfully acknowledge the traditional custodians and their ancestors of the lands, waters and communities right across Australia um, and acknowledge and welcome any First Nations people we have here as part of our event and all First Nations people that we might have online. Um, anyone who's online, it would be just lovely to find out what country you're in. If you want to pop that into the chat, we would absolutely love to find out where you're situated at the moment. Um, and I just wanted to take this brief moment to just share something that's particularly RMIT, which I love being part of. Um, most organisations in Australia have a Reconciliation Action Plan, so a RAP, which is awesome. Um, and that really sets out some of the guidelines that those of us who are non-Indigenous Australians can work towards um, in terms of how we might work together for reconciliation in Australia. And I think all of us think this is super important. But at RMIT, we've moved to another step, um, and it's being led by our amazing Pro Vice Chancellor, Gary Thomas. He's a Pro Vice Chancellor Indigenous, um, and it's a sort of a, an unusual um, but really needed role, and he reports directly to the Vice Chancellor. Um, and he is leading a new way of thinking about reconciliation, and it's called responsible practice. And that idea is that each of us have our own ways of engaging with reconciliation, and every single day in all of the work that we do, we have to think about it. Um, and that also comes down to the pedagogy that we write, how we engage with students, how we engage with each other, and really importantly, how we educate ourselves as non-Indigenous people so that we don't put the cultural burden back on all of our Indigenous colleagues. So I wanted to offer that today as another, in addition to the rooms, um, I think that's a really beautiful way of thinking about reconciliation and I want to offer that to all of you and everyone online um, to think about responsible practice when we're going through our work today. So welcome everyone, it's lovely to have you here and Tim, always an utter delight to work with you. So thanks everyone. Thanks, Claire. I'll